a very uh, special day when we get to uh, uh, greet one of our new newest recruits to the Ottawa Police Service. In this case, it's K9 West. He's going to be a valuable new partner in helping us help residents of the city. And thanks to a very generous donation from the Spurry family, National Service Dogs of Canada, uh, we are the beneficiaries of an accredited canine colleague who will help us reach some of the most vulnerable members of our community. So National Service Dogs is here to help celebrate the launch of um, K9 West with the Ottawa Police Services. He's um, part of their crisis team. Um, he was uh, born and raised with uh, the National Service Dogs team in Cambridge, Ontario. So for the past two years, he's been preparing for his role um, as a facility dog. Uh, well, today it's an exciting day for us as we welcome our newest recruit that's uh, actually a canine uh, partner for all of our folks in uh, victim crisis, uh, in the victim crisis unit. And so they're going to be using uh, this new dog, uh, therapy dog, to assist uh, victims of crime and those that have uh, experienced traumatic uh, events to uh, comfort them as they interact and work with the police uh, around resolution. With the dogs, um, they have a calming effect on people in general, especially for individuals who actually like dogs. So what it does is it takes the stress, some of the stress out of the situation. It creates what uh, a safer space where, where kids or even adults can feel more comfortable. So the, I mean, especially if they have to come into the police station, it's a scary place. Especially the littler you get, the scarier this place is. And the dogs break down that fear. They they set up a, an environment where people. Can can come in and feel comfortable and get a little uh, free love and tell their story to the dog rather than maybe to an adult who's kind of big and scary. You know what? There's been a number of studies around the use of therapy dogs and uh, uh, all will demonstrate the value that they can provide in calming and comforting individuals, especially those when they're in violent situations when they're coming forward to the police service. Uh, you know, we've seen this work quite well already here at the Ottawa Police uh, where a uh, victim of domestic violence was in uh, and, and the dog provided some support and comfort but also for the kids in terms of those uh, families that might be involved so it really is just one other tool that our victim crisis unit can use to uh, to support individuals who have suffered uh, trauma and experienced violence in our community.